Okay, everyone, we are going to show you a quick little video. This is the Home with a Twist YouTube channel, and I also have a blog called homewithatwist.com. And we are putting in a vegetable and herb garden using these galvanized containers. Um, Jabbo's Ace Hardware is one of my blog sponsors, and they graciously provided me with five 17 gallon galvanized tubs. And what we're going to show you today is how to use your drill. We're going to be using a Ryobi cordless power drill to drill holes in the bottoms of your buckets so that you can have adequate drainage um, for your plants. So there's my husband. Can you show us the drill bit that you'll be using so we can get a close-up shot of that? It is a 23-64 drill bit. Okay, so 23 60 fourths drill bit. And we are going to, well, Doug is going to be putting it into his drill. And then we're going to show you, there's no specific pattern. We took the galvanized tub, we put it out on the grass on top of a cardboard box to catch the um, sediment from the drill from the galvanized tub. And then he's just going to kind of do a symmetrical pattern. And he's going to continue to do that. And um, I know it seems kind of like, why would you want to do a repetitive pattern? But the benefit of doing that is that you get equal drainage throughout your container. So there won't be any wet spots. Roots, plant roots do not like to have their feet wet. And that will cause root rot. So we've got five gallon or five 17 gallon buckets that we're going to be putting along the fence. You can see this is perfect for an area in your yard where you don't get grass growth. And we also have to make sure that we don't plant anything in the bed along here because this is a drainage, a flow for drainage. So we're just going to be putting, filling in these spare spots with the galvanized tubs. And we've got sweet peppers, we've got hot peppers, we've got tomatoes, we've got spinach, and couple of other vegetables that we're going to be planting along with a pot of herbs. We're going to transplant these smaller pots of herbs into the galvanized buckets. And Jabbo also graciously provided me with miracle Grow organic potting mix that we're going to be using that, that uh, is guaranteed to produce two times more bounty for your vegetation. So we've got that to work with. So our next video will be showing you how to fill the bottoms of your bucket with rock or shale, potting soil, and then the final video we'll do will be the finished product of planting our vegetables. So stay tuned and be sure to follow our journey over at homewithatwist.com.